next to me you can see the ancient walls of the ancient city of Nicopolis, the city of victory. Nicopolis, or Actia Nicopolis, was the capital city of the Roman province of Epirus Fitus. It was located in the western part of the modern state of Greece. The city was founded in 29 BC by Caesar Augustus in commemoration of his victory in 31 BC over Antony and Cleopatra at the Battle of Actium nearby. It was soon made the major city of the wider region of Epirus. Many impressive ruins of this ancient city may be visited today. Symbolically, the city represented one example of a successful unification of the Roman Empire under one administration. Geographically, it constituted a major transportation and communications link between the eastern and western halves of the Mediterranean. Economically, it served to reorganize and revitalize the region, which had never recovered from its destruction by Lucius Aumelius Paulus Macedonius in the Third Macedonian War or the further destruction under Sulla in 87-86 BC. It also established an important commercial center and port at this strategic position on the Mediterranean Sea routes. Caesar Augustus, also known as Octavian, was the first Roman emperor reigning from 27 BC until his death in 14 AD. His status as the founder of the Roman Principate, that was the first phase of the Roman Empire, has consolidated a legacy as one of the most effective leaders in human history. The reign of Augustus initiated an era of relative peace known as the Pax Romana. The Roman world was largely free from large-scale conflict for more than two centuries, despite continuous wars of imperial expansion on the empire's frontiers and the year long civil war known as the year of the four emperors over the imperial succession. During the first five years or so of the city's foundation, local authorities supervised the construction of the city walls, the majority of the public buildings, including the theater, stadium, gymnasium, Odeon, and the aqueduct. The city's western gate was connected by a road to the Ionian harbour Comaros. The city eventually occupied a site of around 375 acres.
The Odium of ancient Nicopolis is located at the center of the Roman city, near the villa of Menius Antonius, the northwest gate, and part of the early Christian walls at the level of the Arapoporta. This little theater, with space to accommodate about 1,000 people, was designed primarily for musical performances and presents, to a certain degree, the typical features of similar buildings from the end of the first century BC. The basic components of the Odeon are the stage, the orchestra, and the cavea where the audience sat. The Roman Odeon, among the most important and best preserved monuments in Nicopolis, is a true architectural masterpiece by some unknown but great architect. It lies at the center of the town on the west side of the early Christian wall, adjacent to the Roman Forum. It was used for lectures, literary and musical contests and theatrical performances during the Nea Actia religious games honoring Apollo. <laughs> 